we're asked to determine the second derivative of the given function. We have f of x equals five natural log of the quantity secant x plus tangent x. Notice how we do have a composition of functions here, and therefore we do have to apply the chain rule in order to find the derivative. And since the outer function is natural log, we will use the derivative formula. The derivative of natural log u with respect to x is equal to one divided by u times u prime, where u is the inner function, which means in our case u is equal to secant x plus tangent x. So if u is equal to secant x plus tangent x, we can think of the original function as just five natural log u. And now we need to find u prime or du dx, where u prime is equal to the derivative of secant x plus tangent x. The derivative of secant x is secant x times tangent x, plus the derivative of tangent x is equal to secant squared x. Notice how u prime does factor because we have a common factor of secant x. So let's also write u prime in factored form, which is secant x times the quantity tangent x plus secant x. And now let's find the first derivative, where the first derivative is equal to the derivative of five natural log u with respect to x, which is equal to five times one over u times u prime, which in terms of x, we have f prime of x is equal to five times one divided by u, which is secant x plus tangent x. Then we have times u prime. Looking at this denominator here, Let's write u prime in factored form, which is secant x times the quantity tangent x plus secant x. And as a fraction, we have a denominator of one. And remember, addition is commutative, meaning the order of the addition doesn't change the sum, and therefore we do have a common factor of tangent x plus secant x between the numerator and the denominator. The quotient of these two sums simplify to one, giving us a first derivative of just five secant x. Which makes finding the second derivative much easier than finding the first derivative. The second derivative is equal to the derivative of five secant x, which is five secant x times tangent x. I hope you found this helpful.